right, then to update the driver, I'm going to do a download the latest package from HiveOS. Back. All right, so to make this thing complete, I'm just going to do a reboot. All right, so let's do the uh, modifications here. So there's actually a page on HiveOS that tells you kind of what to do. Let's see if I can drag it up here so you can see it. But uh, I'm going to be going off these settings right here. So for the 1660, I'm going to use a 1050 and 37, 1150. So I'm just going to start off with that and see what happens. So right now I don't even have a clock offset on the uh, 1660 Super. Let's do 10. I'm going to lock the core at 1050. And then this one I'm going to change from negative 200. So right now you see it says uh, core clock offset megahertz. This should change to, uh, see it should ab absolute core clock. It just changed. Okay, 1050, 1150, let's go back, apply my flight sheet, um, use MB minor, and we'll see what happens. Let's see, we'll hit minor. Okay, let's see what happens here. All right, picking up shares. Let's see what kind of hash we're getting here. This might take a second for it to kick in. So we got 61 and let's see if this thing even came on, the 1660 Super. Okay, it sees them both. Okay, there we go. Now I'm getting the hash right here. Okay, let's go back to Hive. Okay, so I mean about the same, about the same hash rate. And uh, so this originally the power limit was 120 watt. So now we're down to 114 watt. And the 1660 Super, well, I think it was like 75 watt. And then now it's uh, 64 watt. But uh, even on my, my cell phone, my power meter, it went from 244 to 219.3. So that's a 20 watt savings with the same mega hash. So that's a that's a pretty good savings, you know. That's that's a lot. So yeah, that's probably going to be like maybe I mean it could be anywhere from like 20 to 30 dollars a month depending where you have power at. So um, like I actually live in California, so my power is pretty expensive, but. All right, guys, cool, pretty basic, you know, just make sure you're totally updated. And uh, I'm hoping they can do something like that with AMD. That'd be great. <laughs> but uh, all right, guys, cool. Yeah.